What about the reverse? What is this? Um. Um. <laughs> Don't click the link, guys. Don't click the link. All right, yes, this is Pokemon Infinite Fusions. Yes, you've probably seen it before. And yes, I know I'm late to the party, just like Emerald Rogue. But there was no way I wasn't going to give this a try. I mean, thousands and thousands of custom sprites made by amazing artists of Pokemon that have been fused together. This is a unique Pokemon experience that you won't get anywhere else. And it all starts with choosing our starter Pokemon. Now, normally you'd have to pick between the Kanto starters, but I did some sneaky shenanigans to change that. And if you know me, you'd know why. I think it's pretty obvious which starter I'm picking. Also, let me know which is your favorite fusion Pokemon one in the comments down below it's time to face your dad you were challenged by your rival your dad my father oh ew you fused the two worst starters from joe and they don't get better what are you doing with your life my your dad is not a good check oh never mind why does it get water gun uh okay then Great job. First loss. <laughs> Glad this isn't a nice lock. Why doesn't my dad live in your dad's house? Home. Your dad's house. We're separated. <laughs> yeah, so swiftly moving on from that loss, we make it to Viridian City where I stumbled across the randomizer option and cranked it up to the most random you can get, but only the wild encounters. Now, let's go see if this actually works. Oh. I feel like a sentry should be here. Oh, don't worry. The game is definitely randomized. And after getting our hands on the DNA splices and catching ourselves some fusion material like this Brindum, it was time to play God. Here we go. Our first fusion is... Oh, wait. That's so cool. Yo, it's like he's got a jetpack on his back. Oh, my God. Oh, no. I, I have to catch this. I'm so going to regret catching the milk tank. All right, here we go. What sort of monstrosity have I created? Uh, I... Uh, no, no, no. Just no. Just no. Just no. I am utterly astonished by what I've just done. The less said about that fusion, the better. I then went on to catch a better milk tank fusion, beat up your dad in our rematch, and made our way to the first gym. This gym shouldn't be too bad. I'm going to fight the trainers just because I need some money. A Giorat. <laughs> oh, but we've got this. Mil Milplup is going to carry us through this gym. Hello, Geopi. You stand strong, but you are utterly helpless against my milk. Sandu. Bye, Sandu. Oh my god, it's learning milk drink. Asim's evolving. We're gonna see the Quilava. Oh. Um. Is there a way I can go back? I kind of would rather have the other one. Brock? I, I have to question your choice of fusions here. I can't lie. Oh, wait, it's Doug. Um. Well, that's not that good. That's fine. Bubble. Oh, okay. Yeah. Goodbye. No plus. Yeah, you did take me for granted. You don't disrespect the nipple cow penguin. <laughs> With our first gym badge acquired, we find out that we can apparently gamble an unwanted Pokemon away for a random fusion Pokemon at the Poker Center. Bye, Shiny. Dixie. Oh my god. Hello, Dixie. <laughs> Moving on, we get to Mount Moon, where we find out that Team Rocket is doing something despicable. And rather than going in to stop them, I was too busy making this. What what would happen to Fan Tank if I reversed it? Oh. I I I this is not what I want to see. Is that a nipple at the top of its head? No, 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 no. But Dixie. What happens if we reverse Dixie? Uh, it just. <laughs> It just, it just becomes orange and not yellow. Are you kidding me? That's what I wasted a reversal on. Oh my god. I'm I'm really scared to fuse this one on the left. Just because of what the milk tank fusions have been like. Oh, I, 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 why, why, why? Just why? Okay, what happens if we reverse it? No, 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 no. I'm not fusing. I'm not fusing with milk tank ever again. Oh, okay. That is so much better. Better lit lava. Okay, okay, I'm getting distracted. Let's continue on through Mount Moon and see what other fusions other trainers have in store for us. Jiggly Fairy. I'm sorry, Jiggly Fairy. I'm sorry you have to look at this. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean for this to happen. <laughs> we then find out that Team Rocket are trying to make the first triple fusion Pokemon, and they didn't take kindly to me watching the show unfold. Me? Oh my. God. POV, you fa came face to face with Milplup. All right, let's just quickly put it out of its misery. Well, after all of that and praising the Helix Fossil, I guess the only thing left is to head to Cerulean and challenge the second gym. Or so you'd think. What? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the true God. 
The Mega Nipple. Oh, wait, there's a different sprite. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm keeping this on my teeth. I don't know why I want this milk tank. Oh, oh, that's so cool. Yo, gas lightning Pokemon. Oh, and it gets levitate. Oh my God, it's an electric poison type that has levitate. That's actually so good. Oh, wait, Vixie's evolving. Oh, <laughs> I'm actually in love with this one. Oh, wait. Yo, wait. This one looks cooler. All right. Matanga Banter. Oi. Oh, that's so sick. It's got a Pinocchio nose. All right. All right. We'll go back to the plot for now. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. Regigigas. Wait, 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 wait. If I can catch this, I can get rid of Regigigas' slow start. Regigigas, just get in the ball. Yes, let's go. We got Regigigas. <laughs> yeah, never mind. Forget the story. Uh, uh, um, yeah, no, that's not, that's not staying on the team. Here we go. Don't let me down. Oh, yes. The steel type Reggie, the true steel type Reggie. No, we're not having slow start now that we've actually got a good stats. I don't think you stop me anymore, mate. Oh, Youngster Joey. And oh, Youngster Joey and the King of Retires. No way. He's finally got the top percent. It's a shame. That I have a Metagigas. <laughs> if that fight wasn't enough to show Metagigas' strength, then maybe the gym fight will convince you otherwise. This is how confident I am. I'm only going to bring in Metagigas. That's it. I'm so confident. Nothing else you throw at me is going to stop. Jiggly Dean. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. All right, Metagigas, just do your thing. One dizzy punch to end it all. Oh, no, mind you actually... You know what? You live. Fair enough. I'm just going to use knockoff first. Oh, no. Cute charm. I'm genderless. You can't get me. Ooh, I oh, do. That's a lot of bush right there. But, unfortunately for you, one dizzy pipe. Oh, you know what? You're tanking it, but it doesn't matter. Meta Gigas is just too strong. And with another gym badge comes another chance to gamble an orphan Pokemon away for something better. All right, nobody. 907. Oh. Uh, okay, that's interesting. Go link. Hey, how about a new fusion material capture in Trevenant? I wonder what we can make with that. All right, what what, what do you get with the final form? Ah, uh, 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 okay. The the, sh the silhouette looked way better than the actual product. Maybe the reverse will be better? Okay. Now that is a beware Trevenant fusion that I love. Uh, at this point, if you played through Kanto numerous times like I have, you know the next step is to just go through the SS Sand and then beat up your rival, yada, yada, yada. So let's just skip to the third gym. Ah, right. I remember this puzzle. Oh, my God. I hate this trash puzzle so much. It's literally trash. That's how bad this puzzle is. It's just a bunch of stupid trash. Okay, thank goodness. Screw it, Mega Gigas has got me. I'm so confident. I'm just gonna go with him. Oh, Volpe! It's the same. It's gone. Oh, it's, oh, no mind. It lived. Okay, that paralysis actually might be bad. We can just keep. Yeah, there we go. Nice one, Mega Gigas. Has he got two more Pokemon? That's easy. Oh, okay, that's a ground type actually. Now, now we're in a bit of a sticky situation. He didn't use a ground type move, and it's gone. Never mind. And Rybars is left. Ooh, I love this one. It's kind of reminding me of like you know Gorachu, the beta design. Oh, it's only got a quick attack. He's got nothing to hurt me with. You got? Oh no, it has Thunder Punch. But Met Gigas is just too strong, man. I knew I only needed one Pokemon. With that gym badge, we got another chance at a new team member in the Wonder Trade, and its name is the game's name itself. So surely this has to be something amazing. Um. Oh. Wait, is that Cyndaquil Porygon? No wonder why this game is so good. It was created by a Cyndaquil. So I start making my way through the game and getting some new fusion and fusion materials and fighting this monstrosity. I even missed out on a Groudon in Rock Tunnel, but we eventually make it to Lavender Town to face off against our rival. Right after making some more fusions, of course. If multiple eggs collide, we get Giga Egg. <laughs> Let's check this one out. Oh, uh... I thought it'd be better, I can't lie. You can really tell when they don't have all the custom sprites for certain Pokemon. And this is one of them. Um, wait, wait, what, what is this? Am I seeing this correctly? They, wait, they refused to make a freaking guillotine? Um, 
Yeah, I think we'll leave Fusion there for now. Heading into the tower, we face off against our father, but Metagigas just sweeps through his whole team at this point. And then we begin the plot to get the Sylph Scope, and we're about to make our way to Celadon when I found some amazing fusion material. So... Oh my god, a Gudra. Wait a minute. What? What is this one? Oh, ho, ho. Yo, that's so cool. With another good fusion made, surely the next one will be just as good. Um. Um. Anyways, back on track with the story. Let's go find Erica for our fourth gym back. The door is locked. What? Yeah, never mind. Apparently, we need to go into the sewers of Celadon with Erica to stop Team Rocket. But on the bright side, this event caused our starter to evolve. As, um, it's the evolution. Bond, be so cool. Oh, lit lotion. Yo. Wait, there's got other. Yo. Okay, okay. Well, that one's not good, but these two are sick. Uh, I'm going to go with the more candle looking one, though. That looks like even. Cooler. All right, here we go, Giovanni. What have you got in store for me then? Arnix. I mean, that it pretty much is just Arbok, you know. It's got the same sort of throat size. You're going to stockpile. That's fine. Here comes my sword stance. Acid spray means nothing to me. Another sword stance. Another acid spray. Okay, I sh I'm going to die next acid spray. I should have really just went for the attacks. That's my bad. All right, Metagus has actually been defeated. Okay, we actually got a tense fight for once. All right, Milk Tank, I need you. Body slam him. Yes. Oh, caught. Oh, wait, I've got Scrappy. I've got Scrappy. You thought you could stop me. Hey, back. That's fine. Oh, there's the paralysis. Suck a bunch. I forgot about that. But, hey, we're through. We made it. That's what matters. We've won. Now that we've done the police's job for them, it's time to take on the fourth gym. All right, Erica, what have you got for me? Execute. Ooh. Wait, hang on. That's three heads. Shouldn't it just be two? Okay, that puck did hurt, but I'm going to use Night Slash now. <gasps> no. Okay, well, Abdra, Abdra did nothing. Good to know. All right, Asm, how about you? What a flame burst. Withdrew. And eight. <gasps> Primate, ta <laughs> Primate Tangler just went. <laughs> I don't get why they switched out at that point, but you know, it's fine. Vile, but oh, okay. Okay, now that is a cool fusion. Unfortunately for it, it's just going to die to a flame. But oh, wait, no, I'm, I'm fine with a little bit. I ain't got good damage yet. Oh, okay, we still killed it. Start carrying us this time. We don't need Met Gigas. And with this gym badge comes another wonder tray with one of the best fusions I could have ever asked for. Oh, oh, oh wait, I can't unfuse it. But when they evolve a slacking Mamo Swine, Cannonball's evolving. Oh my god. Sid, is that you? Cannibal evolves again. Killer roll. <laughs> okay, and now Cannibal evolves again. Into. Oh, Pilo King. Wait, wait. Oh my god. That's a freaking sprite for this? Okay, fair enough. I, I kind of prefer this one, though. His final evolution. Cannibal evolves into. Oh, now that is a hench. Eight for Mammoth. Oh, he's got some other ones as well. Oh, oh. No, 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 we're going with this sprite. We're hydro going with this sprite. Now, with that detour out of the way, we can finally go back to the Pokemon Tower to see what fusions are in store for us as we climb to the top. Play a game. Gasco uh, Ghastly, I will put you out of your misery. Do not worry. You don't, you don't need to be living anymore. Oh, wait, is this... This is meant to reference the dead Marowak spirit that's in the actual game. Oh my god, I just re I just noticed the little baby Cubone spirits next to him. Oh my god, this is so cool. I then caught myself a Gibble, failed to catch a Rayquaza, but managed to catch myself a Dialga before making it to Fuchsia City. That's when I realized something. This city has the Safari Zone, a place with a plethora of encounters. <laughs> oh my god, god, god. Okay, okay, hang on, hang on. There's a lot of good fusions we can make. Oh. Uh, 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 um, uh, uh, um, yeah, this experimenting is definitely going to be interesting. Okay, okay, this, this art style did not need to happen, and we all know why it happened. And the bad news keeps getting worse. That successful safari zone hunt out of the way, there's only one thing left to do. Now, 
I don't want to hear anyone judging me. The people want to know what the people want to know. Okay. Is that Sailor Moon? It's just experimenting. That's all I want to know. Um, what happens if I reverse it though? Um, oh wait, no, this looks so cool. Look, I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Just don't judge me. I just need to see it and get over with. See, see, that's not too bad. Okay, last one, I promise. I promise this is the last one. Where's Markiplier when you need him? Smash. Right, we need to unfuse Typhlosion and lit it. And then we can fuse Typhlosion again with Chandelure. Here we go, the final evolution, finally. Oh, yo! One whoopy boy to rule them all. Oh, my God. Okay, yeah, there we go. This... This is more like it. I wonder what happened if I'd fuse these two together. Because they'd be pretty good in the sun team. Oh, hello. Typecott. Freaking bursting with energy. They've got a Dragon Ball and a Genshin Impact reference. No, hang on. I have to pick Klee. I have to use Klee. Wait, what do these two make? Oh, yo. That's actually really cool. Mirafawn finally has legs. Okay, come on. Two behemoths. They've got to make something amazing. Oh, yo. Yo, wait, wait, wait. What was that silhouette? Oh. Go on, Age Slash Dust Dots. Give me something good. Yes. Yes, that is what I am talking about. Oh, look at it. It's magnificent. Wait, what is this? Yo. This looks like straight up something out of Ben 10. My friend told me I should fuse these two together, and I don't know why. Like, it's not the best thing in the world. Is it? Oh, wait, no, it is. They've got your. They've got a SpyX family reference. No way. I thought my game. I, I generally thought my game glitched for a minute. It's just they've made him pop up ads for Porygon. We'll make him even more threatening. Oh, oh, that's pretty cool. He gets, like, all the Reggie's attributes on him. What happens if I reverse it, though? Oh, okay, so it's just like, you know. Giga Chad, Magic Gigas. Wait, wait! <laughs> no, no, wait, wait. There is actually a Giga Chad, Magic Gigas. Oh my god, no way, hang on, yes. Make a Ghost Kyogre. Oh, yo! That's so cool! Okay, both these silhouettes look really cool. We need to see both of them. Hang on, we'll start with this one. Uh, oh, yo! That's sick! Now, what happens if we reverse it? Oh, I, I love this one way more. It's coming out of the distortion world. Okay, I need to use Giroga. These two seem to be a pretty good match, you know? <laughs> Electivire is now going on all fours, you know? Oh, wait, this one looks cooler. Oh, wait, no, ah. Uh, I don't know which one. Wh which one would you guys pick? Let me know down in the comments, you know, because uh, it's actually a difficult choice. I think for now, though, I'm going to go with this one. Say this team of six might be the best team we've made yet this whole time. With our new Amazing Fusions created, I thought it was finally time we continue on with the gym challenge and face off against Koga. But now it might be a good time to tell you that I maybe made a mistake. I forgot that my Pokemon were now severely underleveled. Okay, well, this is not going to work out as I wanted. Nope. <laughs> Magigas, please. Save me. Oh, no, he's not the poison. He's stalling me out. No, no, Magigas, I need you. Please. No, is this deal? What? Oh, no. All right, Gyroga, please. I need to. Water pulse. Confused. Hurt yourself. <gasps> Another water pulse. Okay, okay. One more. One more. Just one more. FIFA. Um, what would this be? I mean, I'm hoping that has bug. Should he? Oh, yes. It is bug type. Oh, my God. Wait. No way. We've done it. We've done it. We're under the level cap and we're going to do it. Let's go, Gyroga. Ch Chanuck. What? I am doing no damage. Oh, and it's toxic. Oh, no. It's going to toxic stall me. No, no. I'm going to be toxic stalled out. Oh, come on. So not only did I forget to level my Pokemon, but Koga also decided to have a tank as his ace that takes no damage. But thankfully, when I bothered to train my Pokemon, this fight was much more simpler. But even at this level, my Giga Chad could barely lay a dent into that chin up. That's a mental. Afterwards, we head over to Saffron City to free Silph Co from Team Rocket's clutches and had to team up with our dad to defeat Giovanni. I just realized they're probably going to be ground types. I am using the electric dragon claw. Yeah, nope. All right, that's fine. Electromix goes down, but guess what? We're fine. I, if you're all ground types, this is perfect. We got Gira Ogre. 
And Origin Pulse hits both. Let's go. Oh, big damage. Wish we could see our fusions a bit more because we're covered up by our teammate. But, you know, it's fine. Gengkon. Oh, my God. God, it's child is a is, is that just Mega Kangaskhan then I guess? But Origin Pulse hits both, big damage. We just got a spam Origin Pulse. This is a single target Origin Pulse now. Nice, Sand Queen. Hello, Sand Queen. Okay, goodbye, Sand Queen. Oh wait, but if I kill it, it shouldn't hit me down. But because... oh, it does. I thought Destiny Bond just only hits one. With Giovanni defeated by the Power Family. I was going to go face off against Sabrina, but then inspiration struck me. I'm afraid to see what this might turn into. Oh, no, never mind. That's so cool. Wait, oh my god. Look at this one as well. Jesus Christ. All right, what can these two beasts give me? Yo, that... It, it's simple, but I quite prefer this, actually. All right, Lapras and Chandelure give me a beautiful ghost to... Oh, yo. Imagine seeing this floating up to you in the lake at night. This would be terrifying. Wait, yo, wait. This, oh, my god. God, what is this monstrosity? I have, I have hopes for this one. I have high hopes. Meganium has died and actually become a good Pokemon. I am so happy now. Okay, you know what? You know I had to do these two. I mean, I, I, that's cute. Oh, there's a little Lapras on the back. That's so adorable. But what if we reversed it? I mean, thick thighs do say... I'm going to stop right there. Let's go challenge the sixth gym. What have you got for me? Pip mine. Pa! Nothing. Oh, I'm going to rinse through this team. You're going to set up. I'm going to set up. You're going to set up. I'm going to set up. Go on, get greedy. You're not greedy. But I'm greedy. Just so now I can shadow sneak your entire team. Just clash. Oh, oh. That's fine. Shadow sneak. Oh, no, it lives. Wait, okay, never mind. I was really expecting dust clash to sweep. It's fine. There is a future sighting coming, so we'll bring out your and we'll start setting up more car mines. Okay, yeah, you can't touch me. Oh uh, yeah, this is gonna be the easiest gym. Your your is literally just gonna sweep through. Oh no, all that HP you took away. <laughs> Where did it go? Right back to me. Ala bro, Jesus! What the hell? I mean it means nothing. Oh no, never mind. That's, I mean, I'm not gonna die, so. Okay, is this how we're gonna play? Is this how we're gonna do it? Is this how we're gonna do it? Yeah, yeah, you just give up. Oh, never mind, you have a max potion. Of course you do. Oh, but your special defense is lowered. There we go, Umbra. Genkazam. Genkazam. Hello. It's a shame you can't touch me. There we go. Uh, <laughs> well, that was easy. As expected, our god squad of powerful fusions is proving to be unbeatable. And so I wasn't the least worried when heading over to Cinnabar Island to face Blaine. I was so confident that I decided to make some more fusions because, you know, why not? Okay, finally a low punny fusion I can actually get behind. Does that mean it would just be like a moving sand castle if I reverse this? Oh, <laughs> yes it is, and that's way cooler. Um, uh, um, what the hell is this? Wait, oh, it's an hourglass. Oh, I get it now. Clone and the original fuse together to mate. I, I, I thought that'd be something cooler. Like this, like this. This is what I was expecting. Yes. Yo, okay. Uh, I need to see both of these, but the, the sprites are giving me a lot of hope right now. Ooh, yep. Mechanical spider firebug. Yep, that makes sense. And now let's reverse this and see this other sprite. Oh, that's like, it's like a fusion between Volcarona and Iron Moth. Oh my God. And they should just have Iron Moth there as well. But this, this is cooler. I just realized, how have I not fused Snorlax and Lopunny together? Like, if my curiosity was going to kill... No. No, no, it can't be. It can't be. You're, no, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't you dare fusions. Don't you... Oh my God. I guess that's the beauty about this game. You can continuously make amazing fusions, but then you discover the one fusion that you're like, okay, that's enough for today. <laughs> Pokemon, Pokemon, Monchon. Wait, is this whole guy's gimmick just to self-destruct? And I'm just using a ghost type to stop it? <laughs> oh, he can't do anything. Yeah, no, I don't even want you to have a chance. You're not allowed to. Oh, no, no, never mind. You are going to. <laughs> and after an explosive battle like that, I'm sure Blaine will be a walk in the park. And it was. I mean, what do you expect him to do against the Abyssal Distortion Lord that is Gira Ogre? But with that out of the way, we can finally continue on with the plot of the game and chase Team Rocket to a volcano to stop them from completing their triple fusion of, you guessed it, 
the legendary birds. Nice to see that they're taking inspiration from the Avengers manga to really make an impactful story. If you haven't given the Avengers manga a read yet, I highly recommend it. Oh, but to whoever made this stupid ass water puzzle, f you. All right, Giovanni, bring it on. Zap Volcuno, the legendary bird fusion. Oh my god. Okay. Wait, Origin Pulse hit it. All of them, right? Okay. Got three health, but yes, that's good damage. Wait, wait, he gets three moves in a row? Oh no, wait. Okay, Origin Pulse, please hit again. Okay, we got rid of one. Garoga's gonna go down though. Wait, okay. And now, and now we bring in Typhoon. Go on, Klee. Eruption. Oh, is that more? Wait. Articuno is the one who survived. It's fine, though. We get a flamethrower now. And there we go. Oh, that fight is sick, though. Just the fact that you have to deal with three hits at once. You want to know what else is sick? Three birds diffused after the fight and became available for capturing. So you know we had to make a detour to get some legendary fusion material. What about you two, then? What are you going to give me? Okay, that's cool. I love the, uh... I love the blue lightning accent. Oh, wait. But in this one, we can actually get... Oh, okay. This is cool. This one's cool. I put if I fuse these two to make a tank of a Pokemon. Oh my god, Snorlax! When did you get all medieval? Oh, I don't have big fat so we lose his fire type weakness. Now what happens if we make the demon god of Wooper and Giratina? <laughs> he wears his headpiece proud after his amazing victory. Oh, that's so cute! Alright, Lugia age slash don't fail me now. Oh armored bird. Oh my god. Wait, this one looks even cooler because you can see the cape. That is so sick. Look at it. Use with your creator Moltres. Oh that now that is a fusion. The flames blend so well. Uh oh wait. Oh my god, we can get Shadow Lugia. Yo. Oh yeah. We're, we're meant to be fighting the gyms, aren't we? Yeah, so we swept Giovanni and got our eighth gym badge. I mean, what did you expect? Gira Ogre is literally just so powerful. It's the best fusion I've ever made. I guess that leaves only one more thing left to do in this game. It's finally time to tackle the Pokemon Infinite Fusions Elite Four. I did debate for a bit, trading out some of my fusions, but then I realized that these guys are the reason I've made it this far. I've grown attached to my Yor lookalike. I'm obsessed with my Dark Abyssal God. These guys got me this far, so it was only right that they send us off in style. And it's a good thing I did. Our Giga Chad literally just swept through Lorelei's team, abusing Dynamic Punch that can never miss, thanks to that no guard ability and a godly attack stat. Against Bruno, Dust Clash slashed his way through Mavaya with a plus six Shadow Sneak. A little Genshin character, Klee, erupted her way to victory. Yule disposes of another carcass. Yura Ogre laughs at the Magnanix. And finally, Electromag strikes from the sky with taking out his ace. Agatha did prove to be a bit of a challenge, though. I did love this amazing Gendon fusion she had, but we did come out with Taurus at the end. Barely, though. Ooh, like, like, just barely. And then there was Lance, the wannabe bird keeper. Will his dragon types be able to stop us in our path to becoming champion? If you guess no, then you'd be correct because you're just swept through his entire team by the last Pokemon. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or you would have been, but you have one more challenge yet. Oh, thanks, Lance. You have, you have to face another trainer. His name is your Dad, oh no, <laughs> he beat the Elite Four before you and he is the real Pokemon champion. Oh my God, I have to face my own father. All right, Nido Geote, we hit you with, we get Earthquake, but I hit you with Ice Beam. You can use full restores all you want. Won't save you now. Ice Beam again. Nice, go on, Giroga. Ogre. All right, who's next? Rhymorta, okay, but we've got an origin post with your name on it. Goodbye. Electodose. Ooh, 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 ooh. This is actually scary. What can I do to this? Go Dust Clash. Dust Clash can come in. Oh, oh, Seven Rain Dance. Must want to hit a guaranteed Thunder. King Shield, just to see what it does. Thunder Punch. There we go. Lower its attack. Oh, wait. I know what we can do. You can walk for me. Oh, okay. Oh, we King Shield. What? I flinched last time. That's stupid. Oh, my God. Okay, well, this has not worked out the way I wanted it to. Thank you, Dust Clash. <laughs> it's fine. The Giga Chad. He comes in clutch whenever we need him. You're going to Dragon Dance. Get rid of your item. Get your damn frock out of here. Okay, so it's actually... We're going to be here for a while. Getting that strength. Yeah, go on. Oh, don't use a full restore. Ah, I mean, Lance must have taught him well. You know, you get to become champion without knowing how to spam full restores. You get paralyzed, but thankfully, Giga Chad does get us through. Oh, and there's the bad starter for Rainium. 
You can thrash me all you want. We'll live. And don't have a punch. Doesn't miss. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Uh, hurt yourself. Oh, no. I let the mints get in here. Hurt itself. Good. Now we can fly up. And it hurt itself again. We come back down. And there goes his stupid starter. Got two Pokemon left. Torto. What the? Torto. Psychic, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Psychic, psychic. Oh, wait. You withdrew? Wait, he's just sent. You were right there. He just sent his Star Kazam and a Crunch. Okay, that's why. Never mind. We, we, we mean to psychic boost, I guess, isn't it? I set up a calm mind. It just set up a reflect. Oh, we're tanking. We're tanking all of this now. Never mind. You're, you've lost. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. It's got cosmic power. No, 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 no. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I, I can't let it. I got to kill it now. The psychic spam. Okay, there we go. Right, Portal's back. Intimidate does nothing to me. Swagger. Is it not going to move to hurt me? Okay, no, it does. He has good game impact. But it's fine. We'll finish it off. Go on, Klee. Your time to shine. Eruption and bye bye, Tortle. And that's the end of Pokemon Infinite Fusions. Or at least it would be. But this game actually has a whole other half to it set in the Johto region three years before the current one we know today. But that's a story for another time.